It's a debate that's reopened every time the Copenhagen Fashion Week rolls around. Fur. And this month's show was no exception. For the past few years, Copenhagen Fur has sponsored the event by offering its product to select designers. But this hasn't gone without controversy. A fur might look glamorous on, on, on the catwalk, but if you know the truth behind it, that it's wild animals that have suffered their whole lives to produce this coat, then it's not such a glamorous product. For the past decade, animal rights organization Anima has staged the protests at the Fashion Week, raising awareness of the mistreatment of fur-producing animals. But this doesn't phase Thomas Anderson. I do not approach them. I do not agree with these guys. If they do not want to wear fur, just don't buy fur. Some Danes have already turned their backs on the fur for ethical reasons. Even department store Magazine has stopped dealing in fur products. But that doesn't mean that the industry is suffering. The consumers, uh, they come from China, mostly from Hong Kong, and they come here uh, five times a year and they buy more and more at even uh, higher prices. So the trend is very, very positive. Almost 90% of Danish fur is exported to China. But how the animals are treated is decided right here in Denmark. What we sell is raw skin to China. Mm -hmm. so, so the ethic takes place in Denmark. Mm -hmm. So the animal welfare program that is uh, established in Denmark is the one that counts for the skin that are sold. For Anima, this welfare program isn't enough. Vinding explains that animals, like mink, are wild and territorial creatures. Keeping them together in small enclosures causes them to grow increasingly frustrated. While he'd like to see Denmark ban fur farming altogether, he says the first step is getting it out the runway. We've seen Oslo Fashion Week take a stand and, and go completely fur-free. We've seen uh, Amsterdam Fashion Week teaming up with anti-fur organizations. We would like to see the Copenhagen Fashion Week do the same, spreading awareness about how animals are treated. Awareness in Europe is growing, but whether Copenhagen Fashion Week will follow its European counterparts is yet to be seen. In Copenhagen, this is Naila Morgan.